contains scotch and sour. Scotch and sour. It's a scotch sour. It's called the. Uh, it's got rum too oh, and brandy. It? But it tastes like a scotch sour. It does the because boss, it's the boss tweed. The boss tweed. That's our host, Ian Andrews. We are going to make you a New Year's Eve cocktail. This is um, December 30th. Is that New Year's Eve? Uh, or is no. it 31st? 30, 31st is December New Year's Eve. We're getting there. Ugh. So this cocktail, my friends, is called the Boss Tweed. Boss Jennifer Tweed. found this. She, she's on the internet sometimes. I'm always on the internet. And, uh, I like the internet. Interwebs. It's plural. There's a lot of them. Oh, yeah. I see. There's only one going as far as I'm concerned. <laughs> so this cocktail. DARPA. 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 Boss tweet. <laughs> so we got has a blend of scotch, whiskey. We're using Chivas Regal. Oh, by the way, while he's doing this, Danny Morris is our executive producer. Hey, what's up, Danny? We got an ounce of brandy. We're using uh, Saint Remy. Saint Remy. Authentic VSOP. What are you doing? <laughs> I just don't want to be in the way. So weird. <laughs> so weird. <laughs> <laughs> and now it's a light rum. We got. I'm that uh, freaky guy that stands behind you and stares. What do we got? Denizen. Denizen rum. My goal this week. Get rid of the bottle. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I've been going finding bottles that are almost half empty, and I am concerned oh, with my bar again. collection. <laughs> trying to cut down a little bit. It's like a diet for your bar. You're trying to, yeah, you're trying, trying to, to turn the line, turn the waistline. Down. We're going to go through all this on New Year's Eve. Yeah, that's all gone. Oh, New Year's Eve, so this is a good I time to I actually. believe it. So, <laughs> you, did you say all the things all I have to Angus are for this recipe? Um, not really. All right, so, so uh, we'll, we'll go through this. Ready, camera, then, blast through it. Yeah, go ahead. Ready? One ounce of blood of scotch, one ounce of brandy, one ounce of light rum, one and a half ounces of lemon juice, one ounce of simple syrup, three dash of Angostura. Done! We're going to cheat on the simple syrup because we ran out of normal, uh, well, it's actually rich simple. We're going to add uh, I keep moving some my Demerara. around this because I keep thinking I'm going to get burned for my little candle. <laughs> That's an LED. Um, yeah, so for New Year's Eve, the plan right now, and I wasn't here for this, and, and it was made when everybody was drunk, but... Best plans uh, are made when you're drunk. Yeah. Best so the plan right now is we're going to live stream on New Year's Eve. I don't know what time. I don't know shit. <laughs> Whenever, you know. Uh, you want me to do don't this again? Bad. Do I have to breathe on this? No, I can't. Right. Um, <laughs> Just use his acid breath. The, the, the plan is at some point, I'm going to go later, probably. I don't know. Let's yeah. say 7, 8 o'clock at night. I don't even know. We will probably be live streaming. You just watch the channel. It'll probably announce it. And we'll be on for a while. So if the you girl the in the red things, will be there. The girl in the red will be here. Chalitha will be here. Red Dan will be here. Um, I don't know what we're doing. There's drinking involved. Drinking. We're going to um, create five drinks according to Dan. Dan says we're creating five drinks. <laughs> creating? So, I guess. I well, well, as far as I know, we, we could be doing an entire episode worth of shows. Yeah. If we're making five well, drinks. Hey, there you go. You might, uh, might, might as well get recorded. something out of them and just have him do it and sit over in the corner. And drink. Yeah. And maybe... Uh, Play in the, the sink or something. <laughs> Hopefully that's wired up by then. It won't be wired up by then. Yeah. I didn't see that happening. Um, so that's the plan for New Year's. This drink, my friends, fill a cocktail shaker with ice. Did you, did you follow the instructions? You're oh, just yeah. talking about oh, shit yeah. up. Oh, yeah. Don't fuck your shit up. Okay. Fill a cocktail shaker with ice. Add remaining ingredients. Well, that's only ice, so it's everything. Uh, <laughs> shake vigorously and straight. This is the stupidest instructions ever. Just fucking shake a drink. That's what basically saying. Um... Blue Mill Tavern in New York City, I guess, is the inventor of this drink. A hearty combination of rum, brandy, scotch, and bitters. Um, oh, it's named after William Treed, Tweed, an infamous 19th century New York City politician known for blatant corruption and erroneous appetite for power! I've never had this before. So Did I wear a syrup? Oh, this, uh, the Eli's. Mm, it's got a little smoky, smoky action to it. Does it? Mm. I'm gonna have to try that. It's gonna be freaking badass! Whoa, it's pink. Right side to die. So we're putting stuff away. I'm talking. I don't have a place to put this. 
All right. Oh, I thought I could get rid of a bottle. I was wrong. Wrong, I'm telling you. Totally failed. Look at here. Hmm. Shoes. Blend of scotch. Like a sour. A sour what? <laughs> like a scotch sour. Sour so onion. A sour lemon. A warhead. A sweet and sour sauce. Duck sauce. Orange chicken. What? <laughs> <laughs> it's a little scotchy. It's like a scotch sour. Mm. Slow train rank. We're not gonna have a camera for you. There's no fourth camera in this episode because my I, I filled the card. Fill the card. Not bad. Too many videos today. It's good though, huh? I like this. This is right up my alley. Except for dog hair, but other than that. Protein. Protein. Dog hair is not protein. It's uh totally protein. skin cells. It's uh, keratin. It's keratin. Yeah. I love carrots. Not really. What? Um, <laughs> no, you see. <laughs> oh, just see. No, what is it? It yeah. gets rid of nyctalopia, which is night blindness. It can be happen when you're driving. That's why you take what? carrots. That's not right. <laughs> yeah, look up nyctalopia, night blindness. I'm carrots. never gonna look up nyctalopia because I feel like I'm gonna find some SpongeBob SquarePants. It's the uh, <laughs> the rhodopsin in the carrots that helps uh, cure nyctalopia, which is night blindness. Question. Yeah. Why the fuck do you know this random shit? <laughs> you, just, you cannot be making that up. You're because cleaning again. That is, Sorry. That is, it's fidgety hander. He's got to find I got to do something this trash right now. I can throw away. <laughs> oh, but we just got to get him a lemon appeal. Did you uh, taste that? Piece. It's really it's, good. It's, it tastes it's like a blind, yeah, right? it's a scotch sour. What you yeah. said is exactly right. It's missing egg white. And, mm -hmm. uh, um, but, but it's so good. I mean... It's a, it's good. It doesn't have the egg white smoothness, but it has the, the, the bitters, which is the great. Sour it has a little bit of that nice Angostura flavor, and then that's what the Angostura's were kind of finishes with. Yeah, yeah. You're uh, juggle, aren't you? No, oh. I'm gonna put these in the fridge so we can use them next week. Another genius maneuver. Yeah, well, um, genius I like maneuvers. the I like the the scotch playing with the Angostura in there. The the oh, citrus dude, yeah. the citrus kind of just. The little, Demerara doesn't take anything away. There's a little I bit think, of the smokiness in there that yeah. maybe comes from the Demerara, maybe comes from the Scotch. Yeah, I think that the Demerara is a probably... Demerara? No, no, you're fine. I already had it. Try yours. It's easy to get to now there's a fridge. <laughs> <laughs> Not a problem. <laughs> it's right there. Um, you want a sample glass? Oh, shit. Uh, you're going to get high on sugar today. Taste it. Yeah, it's like molasses. It reminds me a little bit of actually uh, maple syrup, like real maple syrup. But it doesn't have the oak. It doesn't. Or what is that flavor? Maple. <laughs> there's really no other. Doesn't have the maple. There's no other descriptor for that besides maple. But it's got like that raw sugar taste. Yeah, I mean, it's Demerara. It's raw sugar. It has dark natural sweetness, not as smoky mm -hmm. as it did the first time. It um, really reminds me of like a heavy maple syrup. It is. It's like a grade A. Yeah, grade A. Fancy as fuck. I might not be able to say all the things about beta carotene that you came up with, but I could come up with grade A maple syrup. Yeah. That's a good drink. I like the fact yeah. that it's not smoky with, with uh, peaty scotch. Mm. Um, and the scotch isn't too crazy in there. Yeah, it's good with the shivers because it's kind of yeah. not, it, it doesn't dominate. Oh, we should have used, did we, no, we finished Johnny Walker. We got a long way to go through that one. Um, right. We can do it. <laughs> we can do anything. I got faith in us. Freaking powers. Uh, I, I like it. I, it's a it's a very uh, typical sour with a scotch right. wrapper to it. It's it's not like it's not oh like, my god, I've had anything like this before. It's not outside the box too far. No, it's not too far outside the box um, from a, from a New Year's Eve cocktail. It is potent though because I mean there's an ounce of scotch, an ounce of brandy, an ounce of that's rum. true. It's not there's no it, alcohol taste in there. No, no it's. Um, yeah, I mean, you get the scotch flavor, but not the... It's going to hurt you if you drink too many. Okay, so it is good New Year's Eve drink. Like you drink three of those. Like evil politician that it's named after. Mm. Yeah, you drink three of those, and you'll be an evil politician. You might have to dress up like one. Whatever it takes. What does an evil politician wear? You'll be able to sex with the furry. What does an evil politician what? wear? <laughs> <laughs> you know, like those people who dress up in the costumes. Uh, oh, I know what a furry okay. is. I don't know how that has to do with evil politicians. Because you're so drunk. Okay. All right. I was hoping to be able to... I was trying to march into the answering the question about what a politician wears. But you're let wrong you, with something... I threw that out there to see what you would do, and it did exactly what I was hoping. I'm so predictable. Entertainment value. I'm so predictable. Uh, you, you are. Look at you cleaning. Um... Uh, an evil politician. Shut up, Jen. An evil politician wears a suit without the jacket. Okay. Just the whole tie. Suspenders, red suspenders. They're a little bit bellyish. Now, uh, now I feel like it's Erwin R. Scheisser I'm, from the WWF. I'm thinking right? Boss Hog from. Uh, oh. 
Yeah. He is an evil part. Dude, Dude. Dukes, Dukes, Dukes a Hazard reference up in this bitch. Uh, that I didn't, I didn't see coming. That's pretty good. I don't think you're gonna find an evil politician on the Scrappy's bottles. No, I'm looking for a cardamom. Looking yeah, for cardamom. It's over there. Cardamom. It's up there. Uh, I don't. I, what do you think? Cardamom reminds you of Boss Hog? Someone asked about it. Any thoughts oh, okay. on cardamom? Yes. Yeah, so you should buy cardamom bitters from Scrappy's. Cardamom is also something you see in a lot of Boker's bitters. I don't so. know where it's. It's, yeah, it's so maybe I don't, I don't have a cardamom. You might not. That's I know weird. you have the. Uh, I feet, have cardamom. The feet cardamom. I have lots of cardamom, just not that one apparently. Uh, so there you go. Question of the day. Did anybody send us a good question today? No. Nope. Uh, what's your favorite herb? Have we asked that before? Oh, everybody's gonna say pot. Everyone's gonna say tweed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, no, I want to know what your favorite herb is. Sage. Yeah. What are some other options? Thyme, rosemary, thyme, thyme, rosemary, parsley. Yeah. What would you use parsley. in a cocktail? Like, parsley, if sage, you had to invent you know, rosemary, a cocktail. Like there it is. Question. This is your task. If you were to invent a cocktail with a specific herb, and I'm not gonna say marijuana as a as an herb option, because yeah. obviously everybody who I mean I don't think our I think our people are better than that. I think so too. So what would you pick for your herb? You have to build it. You don't have to do this, but you have to build an entire drink around it. What would be the, your challenge? Where would you? Hmm. What, what herb would you pull from the herb piles? That's interesting. Yeah. Put down in front of you cardamom seeds. Uh, Oregano. Uh, Chinoa bark. Oregano. Oregano. Let's still make a pizza cocktail. <laughs> <sighs> we have to make a pizza cocktail. Pepperoni herb. Yeah. Pep we, we have a I would choose uh, Burger King double cheeseburger herb. <laughs> we <laughs> have a cocktail a, around that. <laughs> we have a muddled pepperoni cocktail we still have to do. I know what you yeah, say. Right. With, with mozzarella for a garnish. So stay tuned for that in the 2016 time frame. Yes. Um, later. 2017 <laughs> time frame. frame. So pick that herb, Don't pull it out. Bread. We got coriander, we got rosemary, we got mint, mint. Oh, yeah. that, that's a coriander push. is the mother of all cilantro. It really is. <laughs> <laughs> you can go to cocktails. Dot. I don't remember the name of it. It's our T-shirt site. Yeah. Cocktails. Dot. It's not Teespring. I don't remember. Uh, basil. <laughs> there's a, there's an option for you. So mint, vanilla. Yeah, there's some great vanilla stuff. Vanilla pods. Do those must count as an herb? Yeah, there's great stuff coming up in the chat room right now. Yeah. That, that's why you have to be part of the live stream because there's right. a chat that goes on continuously. It's very interactive. It's happening right now. Some side Euro conversations. Cilantro. Some not topic. regular cilantro. Euro cilantro. That's like regular cilantro that's Boy, just still stuck in the 80s. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. There you go. Uh, you know where to go. Patreon.com slash GMC. That's where it Or everydaydrinkers.com slash donate. Or everydaydrinkers.com slash newsletter. Or Facebook.com slash cocktail TV. Or go to Twitter and follow Everyday Drinker. Or go to Instagram and follow Everyday Drinkers. Oh, yeah, you get the S in there. That's everything. AwesomeDrinks.com to buy yourself some glassware, cocktail yeah. syrup, Stemmerera, and all the other all stuff, the bitches. Stuff. Bitters. Bitters. That's it. Big bitters. Big on bitters. Nipple pitch. We're done with these shot of drink. That's for you. Let me do it. <laughs> Look at that. This is a drink Jennifer found. <laughs> What's great is when you have the whole egg in here, you get like it's a like really a noggy. noggy, creamy yeah. consistency. It's. <laughs> It adds, it adds something different. Oh, and it's great protein. Oh, oh shit.